everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, I hope you're doing very, very well. Uh, I'm doing fantastic. <laughs> Excuse my face in the back as usual. Uh, we're in the process of uh, doing a lot of remodeling. As you, um, I, I said, <laughs> a lot of remodeling, a continuation remodeling. <laughs> and this door back here actually is going to be put in in my other uh, door opening on this other side and uh, so until but we gotta get the frame out and all the SMS but anyway I just want to apologize for all this stuff that's around here um, today actually I'm going to be doing a kind of a revamping on, on something that I had uh, some little canisters that I had in my uh, bathroom and I bought them god I probably about maybe 15 20 years ago something somewhere around there um i had just remodeled my bathroom at the time and made it kind of a tuscany and what i did is let me show you real quick and i bought a set of this little uh they're kind of plastic they're real pretty really and uh you know i kept all my like my q-tips cottons and that kind of stuff so um let me bring the camera down and uh be able to kind of show you what I, i'm doing okay Alrighty, and there they are. Here's the big one, and I wanted to give it a little bit of a shabby chic, not too much, but a little bit. And uh, so, what I, I think is real pretty. Uh, I use this uh, gold metallic. Uh, it's called um, brushed rose gold, and I just love it. So uh, it was kind of like this, see, and I did it like this. Um, now, what I did to this one, and the, basically the three the same, okay? And I'm gonna be doing the smaller one so you can kind of see. Uh, but I did uh, Mod Posh on them, that way I can clean around it. This is, needs another coat of Mod Posh over it. I already given him one. And then this one has here, it's got two. And I like it better. I don't know, the texture and everything feels so much better. Okay, so let's just get started and uh, we'll, we'll be able to do, kind of show you what I have done. Okay, bring this down a little bit more. And maybe I won't bump my uh, drop out this, this time. And I already cleaned them and everything. This is just from wear and tear. But it, other than that, so what I want to do first thing is go ahead and paint the uh, the lid. And that way it'll be dry by the time we get to it, okay? And I may be doing, uh, you know, back and forth a couple of, because I need to do a couple of um, coats. I guess I'm tongue-tied when I start working on a video. I don't know why. But you know me. So, um anyway i just thought i did this because uh it needed to be done and i thought what would it be awesome to do a project for it and there's a lot of videos out there with some beautiful stuff but this is my way of doing it now i'm going to put a little bit of paint in here just a teeny bit and what i've been doing lately i think i mentioned it i've been putting a little bit of alcohol in it on my paint on my uh, uh even on things that i wanted to dry a little bit faster and it works very well. You don't lose your uh, the color of it. It just gets dry really, really fast. And I like that. Because I don't have a lot of time, so if I'm working on something, I want it to do it, you know, right away. So. And like I said, this is gonna need a couple of loads. Oh, I got Tigger outside, and let me tell you, she's a mess. She wants to go outside, <laughs> but then about five seconds later, well, she's ready to come in. So that's why you're hearing her. Okay. And I'll probably come back to it, you know, here in a little bit and, uh, uh, you know, stop for a second and, and try to do a second coat, okay? But like I say, with this alcohol, it dries fairly fast. There we go. So the first thing I'm going to do, because I want to make sure that everything, you know, uh, tacks down, glues down, or whatever, uh, is give it uh, one good coat of um, Mod Podge. Okay, and uh, 
I'm just gonna go around it in here first and then just like I said just one good nice coat I hope you've been busy doing a lot of putty crafting um, I'm trying very very hard to sh uh, I finally was able to look at some of the editing and I'm gonna play with it for a while with some of my old videos to see how they come out before I actually get brave enough to um, you know to do the new ones <laughs> but I am uh, I'm trying to change a little bit of some of the things uh, I'm gonna be doing a lot of more of the dolls fashions uh, I love to do you know, uh, designing uh, high couture fashions, but I'm not ready to do a bit. That, you know, I'm I'm done with the big big guy stuff, and I I have enjoyed doing it in, on the um, on the dolls. So that's what I'm gonna be doing from now on. Continue with my miniatures. I love my miniatures, but I am gonna change a little bit. How I don't wanna drag the videos, folks. I mean. You know, th for, for, for what is it? Four videos for a little chest? No way. But of course, it had to dry and whatever. Uh, so I'm actually uh, working. Uh, I've been making a, a beautiful little chair. Um, and um, and since I have to make four, well, I'm working on four of them so I can make you a nice, a good complete video. But at the same time, you know, it'll be hours and hours, and I'll have two or three. So uh, that's another thing I'm trying to get done. And some short ones in between, okay? Alrighty, so, you know, that's good. Well, this sets a minute, this one, the big one, needs another coat, so let me just go ahead and give another coat so, while well, that sets a minute, okay? Because it does, it just, and I'm just gonna go just over it. Because if you do go over it, what is so nice about it is that, uh, you know, everything's gonna sit. If it gets dusty, hey, you know, no problem. You can dust it with a little damp cloth or something. And that's what I thought I would do. I'm going in one direction. Uh, I may go across a little bit, but basically I want one direction. And that way you don't have a lot of, you know, different going, different direction streaks. I tell you, I'm happy to get back to work. I mean, you know, well, work for me is doing crafts, right? Um, and right now I'm taking advantage of it because as you well know, comes the summertime, oh my God. Uh, you know, and I am going back to Spain in May, uh, the end of May, first of, you know, in May and June. And so I wanna be sure that I get a lot of my work done this spring before I go, you know, and uh, but now it's the perfect time for me to do a lots and lots of little, lots of videos. So we're gonna take advantage of this. Okay, I think that's done. Well, it keeps moving that direction. <laughs> Alrighty. And I'm gonna put it over here so it'll dry and get it out of the way. And this will be okay because it's gonna be tacky enough for me to work on it, which is good. And this is the applique that I put on on all of them. I just happened to have three with me at a mustache and I thought, fantastic. So this is what I'm gonna be doing, okay? Um, let's see how I wanna put this one because they're all kind of a little, they're all about the same. But since this one is the little one, I might have to come down a little bit. Maybe even more, let me see. Hold it, hold it. I might have to start right there. And, okay, that will work. That's gonna work, okay. Now, right over this, I'm gonna go ahead and mod podge it.
because it was tacky enough for this to adhere and then you know to get glued down and then now I can do this I want to thank you for your comments. Um, that's very sweet of you, ladies. And because um, I really do appreciate them. And, you know, uh, if you're new uh, into my channel, subscribe. I uh, really appreciate it. And uh, we're gonna, I'm going to be doing all kinds of different things. I'm not going to do just one thing. I'm kind of a multimedia crafter, so I never know what I'm going to do. So do, do that. Uh, I will appreciate it, and that way I can stay on and, you know, do it more more videos. Uh, and also, you know, uh, give us a thumb up, you know, if you if you like our video, and of course share. Uh, I share all the videos that um, I watch on on Facebook because you know I feel like they need to, and uh, you know, all of us have different people. And it's kind of nice, you know, to um, to have people share for us, okay? Okay, so see, this is basically it. No biggie, right? <laughs> like I said, I'm trying to make it very, very simple for the for the because. You know, I figured as long as the front is, is decorated, the rest of it is not going to show. So I'm keeping it very simple. I'm going to go ahead and give it another coat in here. See, it's already dry. And it has enough alcohol paint in here that I can still work on it. If there's any kind of uh, thing you all want to see, um, whether it's a, a, a style for the dolls or whatever, just let me know. I'm making for the dolls, I'm making it uh, lingerie, uh, bras, and mine are a bit different, you know, how I go about it than the other people. Uh, there's so many up there, they do a great job. Uh, and uh, so, you know, you got to watch those too. But I'm going to be doing some lingerie and uh, a lot of half fashion and a little bit of everything with the dolls. And the miniatures furnishes right now, basically what I'm doing is a lot of stuff that goes in my dollhouse. But at the same time, I may be making some stuff for my shop. And it may be completely different. So if you have an idea what you want to watch, what you want to see, please let me know. So that I can, uh, it really does help me a lot. Uh... You know, I've been doing videos for about now, it's going on my second year. And after a while, like I said, your little, my brain anyway, goes to mush. So it's nice to, uh, to have an input every once in a while. Okay, this is gonna be drying there for a little bit. And I don't need this, so let me put it up. Alrighty. So now what I'm going to do, I got this at Dollar Tree, it's, uh, uh, it's a sticky uh, rhinestone. I got them both in uh, gold and I got them in silver. But I wanted the gold for this particular uh, project, so uh, I'm, that's what I'm doing. And I just need, uh, let's see, for this one, yes, yeah, about the same, I think, maybe. The other ones, yeah, it's about the same. Uh, it's uh, about three rows, you know, it's, it's good. And it's got a little sticky back, which is kind of nice sometimes. It seems to help. Okay, I'm going to take that off. But like I say, you can put anything you want. Make it, make it, you know, your own. Ooh, it is sticky. Okay, I'm just gonna put that around in here on the bed, on the neck of the uh, this particular container. 
and now this is a little bit narrower in here a little bit wider in here so I'm not really pulling a lot because I just want to make sure so what I'm doing going at the bottom so it'll stay straight like so and then I kind of you know press them down and then that way you know they'll stay they look better anyway and the same thing here and this one I want to do that same thing here I just want them straight so whenever I put the little piece on it's gonna fit just fine and it doesn't look awkward okay and I'm gonna come back here it's about a three you know three layer so Okay, let's see if I can get this little baby out. Yeah. My nails are not that, I mean, my thumbnail is not that long. I mean, that's short, but still. Okay, I'm going to try to get this here. One thing, too, that I did a while ago when I was doing it, too, I just kind of, on some of them, I kind of, Trim them a little bit, no go all the way, just a little bit like this. So when you put them on, it seems to do better. They get closer to the, you know, to the next one. I didn't want to use my good rhinestones for this one because I thought, well, <laughs> you know, this will work. Okay, I'm gonna do the same thing in here, kind of. this way so you can see what I'm doing there we go let's see yeah see three by three so that's what we're gonna put on uh oh okay they kind of stuck on the other side I like, see the kind of opaque look that the, um, and it's not quite, you know, finished yet, but it still will give it the kind of an opaque kind of a color, the Mod Podge, and I like it. I like it a lot. It just makes it look so much better. Okay, now we're going to do another one right at the end in here. And that one is a single one, so I'm just going to cut a single road. And as I said, this is not a long video. I, I I don't think, you know, you can get as much of a short video if you do it right. And I need to do those because uh, by prepping ahead of time, it really does help. There we go. All righty. So I'm just going to bring that over here. And just bring it around. Just one too long. That's okay. Okay, maybe not. It looked like it was going to be... Maybe... Oh, okay, I had to bring it up. Maybe. I guess not. Well, we'll just put it on there anyway. That's okay. And 
like I say, I'm gonna give it another coat of um, probably do a thing. I mean, probably do a thing of a mod podge when I get done, and that also will hold all of these uh, things together because I really don't trust it that much. This uh, little, you know, the glue in there. So, and there it goes so far. Okay, and then I'm gonna print, sprinkle some of the stuff around it. And uh, we shall do that. I just kind of, you know, throws a little bit more of another dimension. Oops, see what I mean? Well, that's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and put E6000 on it. Because I'd rather be safe than sorry. Somebody's knocking at the door, maybe? Yeah. I'm not, I'm busy. <laughs> lock it up. I, I, that's what I heard. Lock. We were back in the house, way back in the house, and uh, my doorbell doesn't work. So, if somebody comes in, they either call me <laughs> or knock it in the window. <laughs> I tell you, that is so funny. When you live in the country, all kinds of spas, everything is possible. Okay. There we go. Seems like it does better with a little bit of the, um, you know, E6000, and I already put it around like that way because like I said, I'm gonna be handling it and I'm going to, you know, dust it off and whatever and then the moisture on the uh, bathroom. So since it's gonna be in the bathroom, I figure, you know, this will be easier than trying to um, just leave it like, like it is. It is sticky, I tell you. Alrighty. And I'm just gonna come and um, kind of alternate basically what I'm doing. Nothing out of this world, but it works for me. <laughs> there we go. Oops. Well, I mean, I got one in my fingers. Sit on the chair. Hmm. Sit on the chair, baby. It's, it's fine. Come on. Bring it down a little bit more. Whoops. And see, so I'm gonna alter in them. So basically, basically, with the exception of, mm -hmm. and it's the same thing on all of them. So I'm gonna skip it. Is that I put some bling right in here and right in here you know just around it a little bit because otherwise it was so wide you couldn't even tell what it was but putting the bling in here and the bling and and, and you know see it that's all i've done now the um the applique already had some uh you know rounds i mean uh, pearls and uh, sequins so the only thing i added was the little round stones see and then see what I'm talking about it's just alternation on it and that really that's it so let me get back to the uh, lid and let me go ahead and do that because it's gonna be the same and it takes a little time to do this okay and I know you're gonna I know you know how to do this all right <clears throat> I tried a while ago and I was gonna go ahead and you know just glue it on with the sticky you know the uh, glue of the rhinestones it didn't work uh, then I tried to put something over and it was you know just bouncing over the direction so I'm gonna have I had to do it with E6000 but also because 
see it's round and uh, even though it has those little threads that you can kind of bend them it still will not do so what I had to do is let me take this thing off here first it's kind of a clip every other one or every two or three other one you know because that way it just seems to do better so I'm you know let you know my mistake so you won't have any problem with it okay and, and this is what I mean oh every so often just oops just one or two just a very top one thread do not cut both of them okay because then you'll you know lock them off and you still want it on one string it's sticky ticky oh, exactly right i just did it <laughs> oh, see what i mean so you have to be careful with it but by trimming it then when i lay it down see it stay better than if i did not trim it otherwise it kind of loop around so I just thought I'd let you know about it so you can you know if you do something you have a, a round lid and you go inside of it well you do it this way there's some of them that you can do this with no problem if I use my good uh, grindstones it's not a problem but for some reason and even when I use some of this it's okay but because it's got that glue behind you know behind that it, it makes it more stiffer and uh, it will not work as well so this is why I mention it and uh, let's see if I can just do the end of the scissors, maybe. I never know how good they're going to cut, see. Okay. I'm just careful with it. Uh, I'm just kind of every two, three of them. And you're not really counting or anything. Okay, there we go. There we go. All righty. You put a little bit more seems to uh, I don't know why it dries so fast normally it's x thousand it dries takes forever to dry okay make sure it's in there you see how much better this is lays down really good but a while ago like I say I had the, I was working with one of the bigger ones I'm not sure which one it was there's one or the other one and I had to completely renew re, redid it because uh, um, you know, it, it just kind of kept going, you know, loop it up on top. And I thought, mm -mm, it's not going to work that way. So I finally pulled it out and did it that way. And it really works so much better. It's like living, learning it. I want to say hello to my little friend, Carol. Uh, and I know you know who she is. You know, she was in the hospital because she fell and she was... A long time uh, seems like it's out of whack and uh, so welcome Carol uh, we missed you and I'm glad you're home now she's a really sweet sweet lady and uh, you know I have really the nicest I had of course I haven't met any of you but uh, you know I feel like I know you for sure and but I get you know that we we'll go through some messages together or something like that every once in a while and and Carol's a sweet sweet lady so I'm glad you're home Carol and uh, I know everything's gonna be fine from now on okay so this I did this in here and for the top I have um, these little diamonds or the plastic but anyway that I got also at Dollar Tree. So see, this is kind of a sort of, sort of mine and Dollar Tree revamp. <laughs> okay, and what I'm going to do, because it's kind of flat, I'm gonna put three down flat. And again, I'm going to uh, glue it with the E6000. Make sure it's center. 
Let me put it this way, otherwise I don't see it. <laughs> okay, make sure it's about right everywhere. It looks like it probably is. Give or take. And then I'm going to put a fourth one. I put three, and then the fourth one, I'm going to put it like that, okay? On top of the middle. There we go. It kind of makes my little handle. We gotta have, we, you know, ladies gotta have lots of bling. So here we are. And where's my little thing here? And here it goes. See this one for some reason, because it's smaller, I'm having problems with it, see? Well, I'll fix it, but you know, it's, uh, that's what I mean. And, uh, you know, you just have to be careful with it and figure out what you need to do. And I think for mine, let's see if I can figure out where that union was, maybe right here. Okay. And I might have to, um, let's see, maybe cut one every once in a while, you know, so that might work. And I'm going to do that and see if it works. So you got to do what you got to do. Okay, let's see if this is going to work this way. So far, so good. See, I'm just going to do it like this. And then in here, I'm going to have to do another one. But that's okay. So the smaller one, okay, this is not, I didn't have that problem with the bigger ones. But the smaller one in here seems to, the way it is made. Okay, let's see now again. I'm going to put this one together. And this one together and this one so sticky it's kind of hard to uh there we go all righty just kind of work with it okay but see i didn't notice that until while well, just now so that's uh that's what happens there we go there we go, okay. And then if I need another one, probably around here, I bet you. Oops. And again, I'm gonna pinch it in the, here in the top that it's gonna lay down nicely on the bottom, okay? Oops. Okay, I'm glad it did, you know, I'm glad it did happen because that way we, I can show you how to fix it, okay? If I don't see it, I cannot help, right? <laughs> Okay, I'm going to do another one in here. And again, bring these two together at the top, you know. And then the rest of it, whoops. See, I'm going to have to do this with E6000. So you cannot really count with this particularly, you know, um, self-adhesive uh, bling so uh, just be careful with it okay but like I said once I get it done and everything it's gonna be fine because like uh, when I put the mop Podge that's going to uh, hold it down quite a bit basically it's gonna glue it on so that's okay but do be careful with it and just pull out one every once in a while on the narrow part of it okay of the neck. See in here needs another one. Okay, there we go. So I'll just bring in it in like so and then just keep on going. All right, there we go. And 
then this one here and then when I put the other one I might have to bring one in the center I may not I don't know yet we'll see okay and like I said the only thing I'm gonna do is put some bling in here some bling in here and a little bit in here just like this one and then give it another coat all of this is going to have another coat of polydura thing i mean not polydura thing excuse me mod podge and i might put a, a coat after that of polydura thing when it's good and dry i don't know but that will take care of uh the uh, the uh, applique or the lace will not get soiled as much because you can wipe it off okay if you don't do it then of course it's gonna get you know dirty eventually by handling or whatever so this way I can clean it out and it's not a problem and I like that so I hope you enjoy these uh, videos and uh, until next time stay well stay crafty and God bless you